Yep, what's good? It's your boy PB3G, and we got some Miles Morales news here today. You know, I spoke about Miles Morales in my previous Spider Man 4 video. It's on the channel right now if you want to check it out. I'll link it at the end of this. But there's been a lot of news about Miles coming out, at least from leakers, that is, not anybody from Sony or Disney. But the leakers are talking about Miles Morales and Spider Man 4. Apparently, he may be showing up in Spider Man 4. I'm going to get into what Film Odyssey, a popular Twitter leaker on all this stuff, is talking about when it comes to Miles Morales. You guys subscribe to the channel, turn on all notifications if you want to keep getting up like updates like these from your boy. Now, there was a Twitter user that asked Film Odyssey, can, um, need some infos about Miles Morales. So Film Odyssey responded and said, won't have a big role in the MCU until after Secret Wars, I believe. Now, let's stop there because I spoke about this in my Spider-Man 4 video. Make sure you guys go check that out. But I spoke up that he that he probably will show up. I'm talking about Miles. He'll probably show up in Spider-Man 4, but I don't think he'll have powers in the movie. Like, I theorize that he won't get his powers until the post credit scene or mid credit scene. You know, he may get his bite in the middle of the movie but i don't think his powers will manifest until the end of spider-man 4 just just judging by how marvel usually handles these type of situations i wouldn't be surprised if they put it at the end of the movie and that way spider-man 5 is probably about two three years away from spider-man 4 so we will see that manifest in spider-man 5 now the twitter user also goes on to say can you say anything about jaden smith so Film Odyssey responds and says, seems like he's gone off their radar. This is based on the fact I haven't heard anything about their meeting in a while. He won't be Miles, though. Now, if you're familiar, Jaden Smith was attached to another comic book character in DC. He actually was attached to Static Shock. Now, there was rumors and some news had came out a few years ago uh, that he was going to play Static Shock on the CW Seed app. You know, CW had their, they well, they still got it. They still got their little CW Seed app. And there was supposed to be a live action Static Shock show on that app. But it never manifested, as you guys know. And he's been connected, uh, Jada Smith, that is, has been connected with Miles Morales for a while, too. But according to Film Odyssey, that will not be happening. He will not be playing Miles in the MCU, which I'm fine with, honestly. I, I, Me personally, I kind of want them to go with an unknown. I know a lot of you guys like Homeboy from Stranger Things. I think he's cool for Miles, too. Uh, I think Jaden Smith is cool for Miles as well. But I'd rather them go with an unknown. I know a lot of y'all don't like Jaden Smith's acting. I actually like Karate Kid, uh, the one with him and Jackie Chan. That's my favorite one. And I like uh, Pursuit of Happiness. Those are the only two things I ever saw him in. So I... That's... Oh, no. And After Earth. After Earth was cool or whatever. But I think Jaden Smith is... Even if they was to go with him, I think he'd be okay for Miles. You guys let me know in the comment section below. What do you think about this uh, Miles Morales news? No real big storyline for him until probably after Secret Wars. That's probably when we'll see him suit up and become Spider-Man after Secret Wars. And let me know what you guys think about Jaina Smith maybe being attached to this role. But now officially, according to Film Odyssey, that is, he's not attached to Miles Morales anymore. You guys let me know in the comment section below what you think about all this. Make sure you check out my Spider-Man 4 video where I go in depth about Miles Morales and Spider-Man 4. So check that out. Check out my other videos. Subscribe to the channel. It's your boy PB3G. I holla. Dang.